Surveys are an effective approach for businesses to measure and evaluate the attitudes, opinions, and satisfaction levels of customers. There are several types of survey methods that include customer satisfaction, employee feedback, product questionnaires, market research, promotional, and census surveys. The benefits of using surveys are that businesses can increase long-term profitability through the analysis of the findings. They can also quickly understand which products and services need improvement. Surveys allow you to obtain feedback which can improve customer loyalty and retention and are an inexpensive way to derive new innovative ideas and stay in touch. In this demonstration, a bank is asking their customers to fill out a survey on a mobile device at the conclusion of their visit. Once the bank has collected some responses, an administrator exports the survey data for further analysis in a spreadsheet application. Finally, Based on the analysis, the bank decides to add a new question and some dynamic logic to the survey and quickly redeploy it. Our bank customer has arrived at the pedestal and begins to fill out the satisfaction survey on the provided tablet. Forms Experience Builder provides palettes of standard and advanced form widgets and layout options that allow designers to quickly create intuitive interfaces. In this case, the bank customer is completing the survey on a mobile tablet device, although the exact same survey could be accessed directly through any supported browser, as well as surfaced through a portal application. Notice the dynamic behavior of changing a section of questions based on the response of another selection. This type of dynamic behavior is very easy to add by configuring the rules associated with items. The customer completes and will then submit the satisfaction survey. The survey submissions are automatically stored in a back-end database and are available for export or even as input into other Forms Experience Builder applications. A Forms Experience Builder administrator has decided to export the current data to a spreadsheet application to do some analysis of all the surveys that have been submitted. From the View Responses screen, the administrator can select more actions, one of which is to export data. The administrator selects the desired output format and then saves the file to the local file system to be opened by the appropriate spreadsheet application. Once inside the spreadsheet application, we can see all the data that has been captured by the survey thus far. All the columns represent input elements from the form. In our scenario, a business analyst has taken the raw survey data and created some charts to visualize the results. After analyzing the initial survey responses, the business has decided that they require an additional question and some additional dynamic behavior to make the form more effective. To do this, the admin person opens the survey application for editing. and selects the target page. He inserts a new row for the new question and inserts a radio list item in the new row. He stretches the item to make it the width of the page and enters the new question text. Next, he launches the property dialog for the radio list item so that he can create all the choices available for selection. Before he leaves the property dialog, he selects the advanced tab where he can change the orientation of the choices. The next task will be to add some new dynamic behavior which will hide the comment field unless the customer's overall satisfaction is either dissatisfied or very dissatisfied. First he selects the comment field and then launches its properties dialog. He then selects the rules tab 
where the necessary conditional logic can be built to achieve the dynamic hiding effect. Notice that the available form items and corresponding constants are provided to allow the user to quickly create simple or complex conditions. Also notice that the interface provides visual feedback such as check marks and warning signs to assist the user in creating well-formed rules. Once the changes are complete, the administrator saves the application. He could have previewed and tested the application right from this interface, although for this demonstration he will test his changes after redeploying. The changed application will not become active until it has been redeployed. The administrator selects the deploy link and then has the opportunity to specify the desired deployment settings, including the option to delete all the previous submission data. After it has been deployed, the administrator launches the application to see its changes. The administrator starts filling out the survey and can quickly see and test the functionality of the new radio list question he added. Next, he wants to test the dynamic hiding behavior of the comment field. He tests all the choices to verify that the comment section only appears when the customer's overall experience is either dissatisfied or very dissatisfied. This demonstration has highlighted a few of the many capabilities that IBM Forms Experience Builder provides. We have shown the ability to easily create a dynamic experience through the use of item rules. We've also shown how quickly a user can edit an application and add new UI elements through the designer. And finally, we have shown how the raw application data can be exported for analysis in common spreadsheet applications.